It is back in custody at the Pueblo County Jail tonight after walking out an open door after taking out the trash. Tonight, we're asking how this could happen. The inmate, Peter Aragon, is a trustee. That means he's allowed more freedom because he's considered low risk. Aragon was found a few hours later on the city's east side and taken back into custody. Carradio News Channel 13's Michelle San Miguel spoke with the Pueblo County Sheriff's Office about the problem. It's no secret the Pueblo County Jail, which sits in the heart of downtown, is well above capacity. So why are taxpayers footing the bill for an inmate considered low risk to be here? When you have a jail that's so overcrowded, why do you have someone serving time for a contempt of court sentence? Uh, well, we're going to have, we answer to the judges, the judges uh, sentence, and in this particular case, that was a municipal judge. Aragon was sentenced to 185 days in jail. About 650 inmates are locked up here right now. Hall says if that population were to get bigger, some low-risk offenders like trustees would be let out. When we do get to a point where our overcrowded conditions are, you know, get etching up to or edging up to 700, then those are the individuals that we release first. The sheriff's office occasionally deals with trustees not coming back from work release, but the last time a non-trustee escaped was in 2007 when two inmates rappelled down the building using bed sheets as rope. It actually makes me really nervous knowing that it's so easy for them to actually walk out of the jail with no problems. They feel low risk. I mean, you not that uh, harmful. Low risk or not, it's concerning to some. It still makes people nervous. It makes the hair on the back of your head stand up just a little bit. That an inmate could simply walk right out of jail. And that was Michelle San Miguel reporting. As for the inmate who walked away yesterday, he will now be at the jail even longer, facing escape charges.